Welcome to Love and My Daughter-in-Law podcast, where my mother-in-law, relationship expert and master certified coach, Leanne Austin, will help you create more love and connection with your daughter-in-law and everyone else you care about. Hey y'all, you're listening to Love and My Daughter-in-Law, episode number 75, Mowing Lawns in the Dark. Recently, I was mowing my lawn. Now, I enjoy mowing the lawn. But there is one thing that I don't like about it. We have an electric lawn mower and the battery doesn't last long enough to mow the entire lawn. So about halfway through, I have to stop and wait 45 minutes while the battery charges and then I can finish mowing the lawn. Now, I know this about our lawn mower. So I will typically edge or pull weeds while I'm waiting for the battery to charge, and it works out just fine. But the other night, I didn't start mowing until later in the evening, and it was getting dark. The last quarter of the yard, when the battery was finally charged, I was mowing in the dark. Now, I kind of have my pattern, and I figured it would be all right to just go ahead and finish because I really, really wanted to get it done and not have to drag everything back out in the morning. As I was mowing back and forth in the dark, chuckling to myself that I was mowing the lawn in the dark and wondering how many spots I would miss because I couldn't really see the lawn, I started thinking about one of my clients in Love of My Daughter-in-Law program. She had mentioned to me something her daughter-in-law did that really bothered her, and she didn't know how to let it go. She even said that things seemed darker for her, and she was hurrying and trying to make things better, but it just didn't seem to be working. This resonated with me as I was mowing the lawn in the dark. How often we are in a hurry and we don't take a few minutes to go get a headlight or pause until morning when we can see things much more clearly. Do you have a relationship with someone where you keep doing and thinking the same old thing, hoping for a change? Well, if you're ready to actually see what is happening in that relationship that is challenging for you, whether it be with your daughter-in-law, your mother-in-law, or anyone you care about, message me. I would love to help. I so appreciate this quote by Corita Kent. Flowers grow out of dark moments. Hmm. Something to think about. Have a good one, y'all. And here's to lawn mowing in the dark and love. If you enjoyed this podcast, check out Leanne's Love and My Daughter-in-Law program, where she coaches and teaches a variety of ways to have more fun and connection in our relationships. Leanne also shares the five secrets she uses to create a beautiful relationship with me and her other daughter-in-law. She's the real deal. I highly recommend you check this out. And if you want one easy question you can keep in your back pocket and use to increase the love you feel for your daughter-in-law today, go to leanneaustin.com and get the one question.